David's book, Becoming a Son, is about the fact that we're already a son on the inside and we have the opportunity to be a son on the outside. So the only way that's going to happen is what's at the core of our being, that which is the truth of who we are, the truth of love, is in charge of this, this lifetime. This we've incarnated into the opportunity to be the the manifestation of the creative process through human being, which is resonant with the, the planet and the purity of this world. We had an expression a number of years ago at Sunrise Ranch, a motto of sorts saying, backed up by the universe. And there is something very true about being backed up by the universe because what's at our very core is a vibration that's complementary and resonant with that. We have the opportunity to be, you know, the lighthouse we've spoken about, the bell tower, to let love radiate without concern for results, to allow something to move out into the world that's of a pure and loving nature. That is our natural nature the given nature of human beings resonant with love, the truth of love. I'm sure many of you over the Christmas time have seen the movie, It's a Wonderful Life, Frank Capra movie. There's something represented in there of George Bailey that shows a man of integrity and dignity and love and support that I find many people gravitate to the movie because it's something that they know they long for experiencing in their life not just to um, know a man like that but to be a person of that kind of character and dignity and i find whatever it takes to open us up to the true nature the the true vibration of the human experience i'll take it i'm not going to miss the opportunity that I have in this lifetime, while I'm still in this body, on this planet, to sound the tone, to let the bell ring, to allow the current of truth, the truth of love to move into the world because I'm alive and I'm saying yes to the core nature of my being.